computers now have primary control of critical functions. Hey everyone, I'm Matt Harbison from SpaceForEverybody.com and today I'm reviewing the Rowan AZ-100. Now this is a traditional alt as mount with all the bells and whistles. And I actually ordered mine with all the bells and whistles. It's an alt as mount which means it moves in the altitude and azimuth um, axes. Now if you keep up with my blog posts, you know that about six months ago I purchased this and did an overview post and I had some photos on there and I kind of just talked about my concerns and what I liked about the mount and I said I was going to put it through its paces and I have certainly done that. I've had it out at my dark site in Marathon, Texas. I've had it out at our local dark site a dozen or so times and I've had it out in my driveway more times than I can count. And what I can tell you about this mount is that it's one of those pieces of equipment that you forget you have because it just works that well. Now I'm an old school guy and that's what brought me to this mount because it has slow motion controls. And that's a tall order these days. They don't make a lot of mounts with slow motion controls. I think the Vixen Porta, maybe the Scope Tech Zero, um, certainly this one. Uh, but the slow motion controls, when I'm sitting at the eyepiece, I just forget I'm there. As I turn those knobs, I kind of fall into the eyepiece. And that's what happens with this thing. Now, I've set mine up with the optional aiming device so that when you put two scopes on here, they're both pointed to the same thing. And I keep about a five or six degree field scope on this side and about a one degree on this side. And I can move it, you know, depending on the eyepiece back and forth. So it's really a nice experience when you're looking for messy objects or difficult things because you get a perspective from a wide field and a narrow really quick. Um, so it's all mounted on a ball box wooden tripod, which I'm a big fan of. And again, this thing just kind of fades away into the background, which is what you want. Now, Rowan actually sells a motorized kit for this. Now, I, di I did not purchase that, uh, but you can. I did purchase it with encoders. So with about two to three stars or points in the sky, this thing knows where it is. And I highly recommend you get the encoders. Now, this is a Nexus uh, DSC Pro from Astro Devices. And I'm gonna do another review on just this little guy because I love it so much, I really wanna put it through its paces and talk to you about it because this is worth your time. This whole mount uh, is worth your time. If you want the best, then this is it. I haven't found anything better. I used a Dismount 4 for about a year and it's great, but it doesn't have slow motion controls. So certainly consider this one if you're looking for an alt as mount. Um, don't forget to find us on Facebook and Instagram. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments below. I'm also going to link uh, my blog post about the Rowan down here. I'm going to also put some video at the end of this so you can see it a little bit better. If you have any questions, don't forget to ask them. Please subscribe to us on YouTube. And don't forget, there is space for everybody. Peace.